Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm Laura, and as you can see, I'm back at it again out on the street, getting me some miles in. So this video is gonna be a little bit about touching base on my six week out post-op arthroscopic knee surgery and how I'm recovering. So last week, I only had PT once, which was like on Monday. And I really wasn't a really good patient this week. I didn't do a lot of my exercises that I was supposed to. And she wanted me to walk four miles this weekend. So I decided to do it this morning. Got out here and I'm not going to lie, every step has hurt. I'm not sure if it's because I didn't do enough this past week. Didn't do my exercises. I don't know. But my knee has been, and I say hurt, but it's more like aggravated, just... A little bothered yes I feel it every step it's not a shooting pain or anything like that so I don't think I've messed anything up I think I've just aggravated it or something I don't know maybe the four miles is aggravating it I'm about three and a half right now and I'm tired <laughs> but <clears throat> one thing I am learning slowly over this is that I have to lower my expectations this whole time I've been saying I was gonna bounce back from this think I'd do really well, not have any issues or problems, and for the most part, I really haven't. But my problem has been expecting too much. Even my therapist keeps telling me, physical therapist, you're pushing yourself, you're expecting too much, you're trying to get back out there to running halves, you got to take time. It's got to take time to heal. It can take 12 weeks for all the tissue to heal around the knee, all the swelling to finally go down. And here I am at week three and four, wanting to try to get out there and walk a 10K. So I'm trying to get my expectations to be more realistic, be real about where I am, that my journey with my knee is going well, it is healing, and I am moving. So it's all positives, I know. It's just I am so impatient. Good Lord, I'm an impatient person. But anyways, so we're doing four miles today. I bargained with her last week. I talked about it a little bit. And uh, she's going to let me walk the 10K. Lightning's pretty good. Um, next weekend for the Houston half. She did tell me that the one stipulation is if I am walking and I get tired at any point during those 6.2 miles, even if it's every half mile or mile, sit my bottom down on the ground, side of the curve, side of the road, wherever, and rest. I think the time for the half marathon is like three and a half or four hours. And since I'm only doing a 10K, and it's pretty much the same course out and back, that I've got four hours to do 6.2 miles. I think I can do that, <laughs> considering it's taken me two hours to do like four miles, maybe even more than that, to be honest, right now, a little over two hours, but I think I can do it. It's just, I'm going to be really tired. I'm curious to see how the rest of the day goes for me after doing these four miles, as I'm feeling it right now. It's hot here in Texas, as you can see. We're in mid-October, and it's 77 degrees outside. So, with all that being said, I'm going to get this 10K down next weekend, even if I have to crawl it, because I'm that hard-headed and that impatient, and I want that flipping metal. You guys will learn it's all about the bling for me. Every last race. I hate running. I hate exercising. I really don't mind sweating. I'm a little bit of a weirdo in that aspect. I like to sweat because I feel like I've done something. I like to do yard work, stuff like that. But as far as running, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. But I do it because of the social part of it. There's so many people I have met through this lifestyle. And I travel with so many ladies and have a great and wonderful time. That's the reason why I do it. I don't like to run. My body doesn't like to run. I'm a fat girl. Fat girls don't like to run. We do run, but we don't like it, most of us. But anyways. So, knee is getting better. Slowly but surely. I am on the men's, I am on the healing process. Today, like I said, it's been a little aggravated, I think. Really, I'm thinking it's because I didn't do enough last week. I didn't exercise it enough. And 
make it more pliable, flexible, or whatever. That's my own fault. But uh, I'll do better this week. I do have PT twice this coming week. And I'm going to try to bicycle a little more. That's something I should be doing every day, and I haven't been. Last week, I don't know what was wrong with me last week. I just couldn't seem to get my myself together. It was just, well, no, I do. I had a, a death in the family. So it, in the middle of the week was a funeral, and it was just an off week for me. So anyhow, I'll cut myself a little slack there. Next week's going to be better. And next weekend, we're going to do the 10K. First race since surgery. I'm actually excited. Not going to be excited about the time, but I'm excited to do it. <laughs> uh, so anyways, just want to let y'all know I'm wrapping up my four mile walk. Next week is going to be 6.2 and uh, I get to see the doctor and hopefully he'll clear me and tell me I can start trying to get back into slowly jogging again. And so Lord willing, body keeps going on the up and up. I'm going to attempt my first half in December since surgery. So anyways, you just got to keep pushing. Your body will finally heal, Laura. I know it will. But right now, it's just, it's been a battle. Mentally, mainly for me. Physically, I am starting to get my energy level back. My stamina, I can tell, is starting to get there. I'm able to do a little more. I can stand. I can walk. I can go hang out with my friends. So the stamina is slowly coming back. That first month, I had no energy. Couldn't do anything. I couldn't even stand for more than 15 minutes at a time. Had to go sit down. Doing the dishes was real fun. Cooking was a blast, let me tell you. Oh, but I'm getting there. So happy to report that six weeks out, I'm feeling optimistic. I'm learning that my expectations were way too high and that you know, 12 week recovery is total recovery time should be about 12 weeks. I just thought I would do so much better. I'm so hard headed. <laughs> I really am. But anyways, all right, guys, I will see you soon. If you like my little journeys that I'm on, which are several right now <laughs> between weight loss, knee recovery and finishing my crazy half marathon goals. <laughs> Like and subscribe. Hit the buttons. I will see y'all later. Bye. Oh, freaky. Oh, Lordy, gotta love Halloween.